now call on Colonel Jones to just explain what the mission of the uh, military, the Army, is at Fort Ord. And then we'll also uh, bring Colonel Jones back if we get into any of the questions you might have about uh, transmission of property. I will also bring a map, but instead of bringing a map for everyone, I bought one map for everyone. <laughs>
within that secretary, and there be command within that secretary, whether it's Army, Navy, Air Force, or Marine, and then every person who thinks he's important <laughs> in, that, in that process has to have an approval, has to see the plan, has to see how much, has to know why, has to know the cause, has to know even the community concern. And that leads me into the and to one of our, our prime uh, action is that every step of the way, we try to have community involvement, whether it's through four, whether it's through, uh, we have an organization called the RAF, whether, whether it's through a uh, individual, and we have done that, and even in the UXO cleanup, individuals have come on the post <coughs> and designated the area. You know, old time coming on the base that we used to throw hand grenades at this area. We have, we'll stop what we're doing and go and check that area out. So it, it's not just organizational that we, we do try to incorporate uh, community ideas, individual ideas and thought in, within the process. We uh, try to publicize what we are doing in a, in a various number of ways. Uh, first, we have weekly weekly uh, meetings with the Army, uh, with the Navy Postgraduate School, and on call. And we're basically the weekly meetings are to tell what it, we are doing at the time. We have monthly meetings with the Sacramento Corps of Engineers who act as the real estate agency for the Army and to let us know where, they're, where they are in the process for the transfer of certain properties. The property transfer are prioritized by the plural organization and given to the Army to execute. Uh, we also have a quarterly meeting here at the, uh, so far it has been here at the Presidio with the DA folk, uh, the uh, MACOM folk, with the major commands in the Army, and the commands that affect the fossil processes that we are trying to transfer at the, at the moment. For instance, in the telephone, we call it the communications command. In the uh, water or utilities uh, arena, we call the uh, uh, public works command to come out here to, to, to give them an idea of where we're going and how to get there. And then on call, we have a meeting to meet. And, and today is, in, is an example. We call we have community meetings to let the community know uh, where the Army is in the process of transferring property. It is not a, an easy process. Uh, the rules and regulations that we are governed by are very constant. And uh, the regulations for uh, transferring a piece of property seems to change with each piece of property because each piece of property happens to be very unique. Uh, and the properties that I have transferred so far, I haven't did the process the same way. I haven't duplicated the process yet. So each action is a quick inventing something new. I would like to uh, leave my phone number with you uh, in case uh, you have other community uh, organizations or if you have a question and uh, I don't I don't have the phone. <laughs> Give that number out to anyone. <laughs>